Oh, we need Krita X Ultra's fiction immediately. For you, Hex. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> Qu Queenus slash Ultras written by Edgar Ronnie. <laughs> Figaro. <laughs> Edgar and Ultras get washed down the river and appear in Final Fantasy IX. They meet Krita and sexual hijinks ensues. <laughs> what? Alright, now this time we're gonna kill him. I, I just um, woke up! <laughs> so, <laughs> like... <laughs> it. You came you came on the recording with me, Hex. You should have known what you were getting. I, 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 I know. I, I really should have expected that. But, hey. Hey, Odin worked for once. I know, it's great. What what next, bloody... I'm just showing off the offering here. Yeah. Um, it sucks if you use it with... Uh, Anything things that don't... That don't use yeah. its absolutely broken, like, strength. Yeah. Yeah. It's like the fixed it dice. It sucks with things... Yeah. Really, offering is really only good with fixed dice. Uh, well, the ultimate Unless weapon, you grind like crazy. Like, I think the ultimate weapon ignores it, too. Yeah. Doesn't the Valiant uh, knife as well, or...? I'm not sure, I think yeah. It does. it does, but the thing problem is that like, the Valiant knife and Ultimate Weapon are opposite yeah. Oh yeah, things. I forgot about that. So it's not all that gotta, useful. Like, pump lock strength up to the point where it doesn't matter. Yeah. Yeah. Which, where it's just not mm -hmm. practical. Unless you're playing the advanced release. Yeah. Uh, if Terra's here, she mentions that, you know, love with an Esper. Something like that. Yeah, love with a human and Esper is yeah. really. It just borders on furry right there. Yeah. Well, hey, you can blame the city. But I don't want don't to insult uh, Drake's true love, so. <laughs> yeah, I'm not gonna go with that. It's okay. There'll be a letter it bomb on the way by the morning. <laughs> So here, here am I trying to remember how to count to five. Um, <laughs> uh, no, it, it's one, it's four, one, two, <laughs> seventy-two, um, seventy-eight, not ninety-eight. Um, this is so much better at this than I am. Shit, shit, guys, how do we count to five? I have no idea. Shit. <laughs> Let's play counting. Did you did I? Damn, I can't remember if I carried the remainder or not. It's the blue dragon. The worst dragon. Yeah. Isn't that the holy dragon? <laughs> really? No, this guy's worse. I loved the holy dragon. He was really easy. Then came the advance release. Flapping now. <laughs> oh, man. I think the blue dragon's even the worst one in the advance release, yeah. too. He, he, <laughs> just, he, he does the same thing as he does here. He just has higher stats. Yeah, I mean... I I was like, in you know, advanced race, I'm expecting him to, like, you've got to deplete all his MP and then do a handstand and then do a backflip. But... Yeah, for, Wait, uh, you... for the viewers who haven't played the advanced version, uh, the Weeborn Holy Dragon in the bonus dungeon, he gets Heartless Angel, and he can use this group attack, like, three or four times a turn. And it's wholly elemental, and, like, only three pieces of equipment is toy. So, have fun. Literally three, because you just listed them. Oh, yeah. <laughs> and that's a story for another time. The event for this. Yeah. Maybe I'll maybe I'll do that. Just play through play through the. Well, really, all you'd have to do is the dragons den and then Omega. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, I still would have to play through Final Fantasy VI again, but I could do that pretty quickly. Yeah, and then just just, just just grind the final boss for a bit to steal Ragnaroks. <laughs> You yeah, get Xeno to rocks. hack the game for you. Yeah, I'm not that invested. I remember that when I worked the walkthrough for the game, I actually, it was the advanced version, I got right up to Omega. And then somehow my data got erased. I didn't finish the walkthrough for two months, because I'm like, fuck that, I ain't doing it all over again. <sighs> yeah. What was that? And so... Sounds 
text? Are you having intercourse with someone there? No. It's not touching yourself. Only I may do that. What? What? <laughs> what, what, what? <laughs> so apparently... So apparently by talking to Celeste, we can now get, um... Raiden. <laughs> we now we know Raiden. Cut. Poor Skate's trying to keep us on topic. God damn it, Skate. Yep. <laughs> I'm sorry. If I can be on topic, one of the things I find funny is the only hint to the ancient castle and how to find it is one of those thieves at the bottom. But to get, but the hint is that you have to pay him 500,000 bucks. Something like that. Oh and yeah, I made, I made that yeah. mistake, like on my first playthrough. Oh no. It's like, hey did you know, if you're not an idiot, you can... Yeah. So, well if you didn't so, you know, know about the castle, how would you ever find it? Why would you ever want to ride the figure of castle again? Yeah. yeah. Um, so, I brought Umaru here because people are like, you know, Umaru is great in, you know, the cultist tower, but he's not. He's never great. So, he, he literally just sits there and does nothing? Oh. No, he just attacks. Oh. And I hit him with fire spells. He gave him the blizzard orb, right? Here? No, because the blizzard orb isn't really all that good. Oh. Uh -huh. The rage ring is much better. I forgot though, what does he do with the blizzard orb again? Like, he uses some kind of, um, I heard he's, he uses some sort of magic with it, yeah, but I didn't know what it was. Yeah, he casts, like, a blizzard, like, ice storm or something like that on blizzard. enemies randomly. Yeah, but it sucks, Yeah. so... Yep. Because Umur has the, has the terrible magic stat. Yeah. He's a yeah, you heavy, what do you expect? <laughs> Umero, the mean old yeti. No one will get that um, joke, but the people who do. Yes. <laughs> uh, the problem with uh, the cultist tower is not because it's not because like you only have to cast magic. Magic is really great in Final Fantasy yeah. VI. It's it's because um, the enemies just get so many turns on you. Yeah. It's for some reason they, they get three or four turns to your one. That and so it's so long. Miss yeah, yeah, yeah it's it's a just, long it just tower takes and... forever to go up. And there's no save points. It does, and then and in some of the battles, you just have to keep casting. You know, you have to keep casting magic on yourself and bounce it off and reflect. Because most most of these most of these monsters have reflect on them, so yeah, yeah, they really suck. That's what I'm doing right now is just ca bouncing fire threes off myself. I never used wall wings. I figured out that hey, you can't reflect all my bitches. So yeah. That's the strategy it's of Final Fantasy VI in a nutshell, Ultima. Yeah. Yeah. I didn't have Ultima on these guys yet. I could have brought Strago, You don't have but... Ultima on Terra yet? Wait, how, how no. darn you? What? <sighs> like, even I did. I, I, <laughs> I, I didn't really, like, do all that good at this game. Eh. Yeah. Involved but then grinding, again, and I, I wanted some... I, I at least could do blitzes, so... This is going on <laughs> a strong the trope page now under Epic Fail. Skate does not teach uh... Terra Ultima. She has the Paladin yep. shield on now. Alright then. As, as Umru floats across the screen. And a bit of whoring for those of you wondering what I meant. We have a LP page, we have a TV Tropes page for the LP now. Yeah. I actually mentioned that on Yaris and y uh, Yen, Yen said shut the fuck up, so... <laughs> what?! <laughs> No, no, I didn't. I didn't mean it that way. But I mean, you know, you know how you know how she she doesn't swear. But I just kind of exaggerated it. <laughs> I mean, I, I would have some like jazz hands now to sell the TV tropes page, but this is an audio recording. Yeah. So yeah, you pretend, do a trailer. Pretend, then. Just pretend. Now coming yeah, to judge. TV tropes. It's the Final Fantasy Wiki. Let's play. So he be here you know, as we document all our tropes together with you. In a world <laughs> where Umaru is muted, and Strong has yet to return. <laughs> <sighs> oh shit, Umaru is muted. Sh <laughs> shit, what am I ever gonna shit do? Shit is going down. He did not just miss that door, oh my god. Oh, I got that. He did? Yeah. I got it in an early recording, where with Mog, it's the air anchor. Yeah. The air anchor is pretty awesome. Yeah. It's probably the 
Edgo is pretty awesome. Hmm, you would say that, wouldn't you? Well, I, I swear Edgar is Drake's, like, inspiration. Nah. The Don's my inspiration. I think the fanfics have proven that. You mean you mean there's a Don Queen of fanfics? Okay, sure. Let's go with that. <laughs> um. I if so, I can add to the TV talk page that I've made them a medic molest. <laughs> That's Edgar, really. No one can top Edgar. Oh, you underestimate my power. I don't yes, know about please that. Please tell us more of your your really really twisted fantasies on the LP, on uh, with Edgar and those tentacles. <laughs> hey, maybe even more on Gogo and. I just realized. Yeah, why don't we do something with Gogo, Umro, and Mop doing a threesome? Great. Well, I yeah. just just spoiled my death teaser for my next pick. <laughs> Yeah, please, please write write that down and put put me on put me on the credits. Like say, like, Choco Lancer, the right, sick, most like, sickest um, fuck ever. <laughs> <laughs> I was I was thinking, you know, the Gogo, um, in the United States Senate fanfic. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> where where he tries to pass a bill like I don't know. He just stands on the center floor talking, and when they ask what the hell he's doing, he says he's mimicking the senators talking and getting all <laughs> done. Yeah. That is one epic bong that guy at the bottom has. <laughs> <laughs> and I fucking stowed, there's a vibe throwing fireballs and shit. <laughs> It's actually the twist at the end of Final Fantasy VI. It, it is all just one dream. It's a dream. Yeah. It's a dream made up by this green guy. <laughs> Some green skeleton just... Actually, when we kill him, the game will end. Yeah. You can tell he's stoned because he has no clothes. He's just covering himself with a cloak. <laughs> and that was Final Fantasy VI. <laughs> oh, wait, there's more? This tower is long, yeah. and it is tedious. But thankfully, <sighs> I start cutting out battles soon when they start repeating. Oh uh, yeah. Here's the magic I urns. I think I only ever encountered the magic urn maybe twice. Yeah, maybe once or twice or something like that. They're, because, they're you know, annoying. That's it. Well, they're like a, they're basically recharge. Yeah, at least they don't kill you. Yeah, you, uh, you get osmos off them to fill up your MP in that because they don't do anything. Yeah. I've seen them throw an elixirs at me before. Then came the advance but... release and they got bitchy. <laughs> <laughs> they, that only started in Final Fantasy VII, really. It's, it's the... At least they're not as Oops. fucking annoying as they are in bloody 10. 12. Oh, those things are the worst. Worst ones are in Crisis Core. Listen, uh, because you have to get them as the whole. Nah, they're all awful. Like the one in Crisis Core, like the one, of course, that drops one of the Genji items. You gotta use Octa Slash to appease them. What a shock! It's random. Yep. That oh, that the that, bad. that does seem very typical of. I didn't like Crisis Core, but I'm, there are people who are out there who like it. I haven't I'm played it. Like I wanted to. It's just. Crisis Core never... is okay. It's mostly notable because it's the fun one Final Fantasy VII spin-off that doesn't suck. That's its yeah. claim to fame. It's, a... it's less I mean, bad it's, it's... than the others. I mean, it's probably the best spin-off Square has ever made. But that says very little. I thought it was decent, but um, I thought it was annoying too, though, because it was 60% uh, side quests oh, yeah. and the rest is just stories. Like, really small. Yeah. Really small part of the game. It was really grinding, and it involved pressing X a lot, and I got bored. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, fuck the missions. You got two, three hundred missions, cut out two hundred of them, and do a better main story. Please. Yeah. 